So with a well-fed stomach, now it's just a matter of killing time and waiting for the sun to go down. You see, every proper day trip to Marfa must include nightfall, because as the sun sets, a different kind of visitor comes to town. The Marfa Lights. And another friend for the finale of this day trip, local expert Tex Toller. All right, man, so I've heard a lot about the Marfa Lights, and this is, we just look out here and they show up? They're, you know, they're not on a schedule like the, like the geyser at Yellowstone, <laughs> but yeah, people see them, and uh, uh, I've seen them several times since I was a kid. What's the explanation? You know, they've had people come here and, and do seismic studies, geothermal and electromagnetic, and they don't know what it is. That's why they're called uh, mystery lights. Aha! Uh -huh. And some people will only see the car lights coming on 67, but since they have been seen since the 1880s, it's unlikely that there were car lights out there. Yeah, very unlikely, I'd say. Well, I like a good mystery, and so I'm happy just saying, hey, this is an unexplained phenomenon, and we just enjoy it. Now we just, we just settle in. Settle in and wait. And wait we do. And the sun goes down, and we keep waiting. But then, Whoa, 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 what's that, what's that? Look over there. That little little pinpoint of light just appeared on the horizon. Yeah, 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 that's a Marfa light. You know, you don't know if you're gonna see one, but boom, there it is. Wait, 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 but what's that? Over there. Yeah, that's a Marfa light too. Wait, but it's getting closer. Whoa, 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 guys. Guys, that's coming right up on us. What, wait, what is that? 